Oh, I missed two things. Actually, I probably didn't get what was ever, whatever was in the hostage box. The enemy forces All right, let's see. their suppression of Beverly Hills. This is due to information that leaked out regarding some millionaires who are amassing capital to fund the resistance. <laughs> While the number of soldiers equipped with heavy firearms is great, if you pay higher attention to their attacks, they're no threat to your mobile armor. The vehicles in this battlefield are violent. Consider the advantages and disadvantages in the geographical features as you destroy all the target areas in the town. I think... This mission goes by the call name... Yeah, I'll do this one. I think this is a fairly straightforward thing. Bring fashion back to the streets. Bring fashion back to the streets. Good luck and God Whatever. Me, Mr. President. <laughs> Let's get back into the uh, development for a second here. Okay, let's see. Back up to... not that. Yeah, the sniper rifle. Actually... Well, ugh. So it's hard to decide how to do this. Ooh, whoops. And keep forgetting to go up! Alright. Curious. And BAM! And then they turn into chain guns, which is awesome. Almost done with that one. Almost done with the sniper rifle too, I imagine, because I've been dumping all my money into only two weapon types. Yep. I won't worry about it for now. I'm trying to put off those, those missions that I want those uh, weapons, like, really for. Uh, until I've got those guns. And then I'll just start making other stuff for shits. Shits and also giggles. The best reason. Enemy explosive devices are planted all over the city of Beverly Hills. Destroy all the bombs and liberate the town. And by destroy all the bombs, we mean basically set them off yourself. Roger that. Like, you can't make them not blow up. It's kind of silly. This is DNN's yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, bombs I don't care have been laid out all over town. Clean up the bombs while destroying the radar jamming stations. Some right. scientists were among the POWs you rescued. They were used to develop new weapons for the military. That's a radar jamming station. Ah, if come you destroy on. it, yes. the bombs will Get surely it. show up on radar. Hey, money. I want that. There we go. Or something. Money, I think. Whenever it's in Japanese with that, the actual uh, one number one in percent sign after it, it seems to be money. But I'm not really sure how that works. You'd think you'd just get money in like set batches, but it seems like it's... I'm not really sure. And I've never really looked into it, because mostly the, the majority of the money the you'll Mr. get... President, that's a bomb! That's a bomb! Thanks! Uh, most of the money you'll care about is just going to come from completing missions themselves, because you get paid at the end of the mission. And the missions with bosses tend to pay out the most. Not all missions actually have a boss. This one, for example, does not have a boss at the end. The last one didn't really either. That's it. I don't actually know what that is. <laughs> Didn't I just oh. say, if approached carelessly, it will detonate? Don't be so lax. Okay. Is there some other way to do them? I don't know. I always just shoot them. Same way I solve all my problems. Oh, uh, this looks promising. Time for helicopters. The pride of the U.S. military. Blackhawks raise their ugly heads. <laughs> Why would he call them ugly heads if he's, tell he's trying to, like sing their praises or something. Back up a little. Dang it. Yeah, let's get rid of these guys. As we saw in that last stage, having missiles fired at you constantly is pretty irritating. Even if it's not all that damaging, it'll constantly interrupt your jumps and such. One of the other of the stages I'm going to be doing right now uh, has a lot of not a lot of quote-unquote platforming, but there's a lot of falling to your death if you're not careful, and unsurprisingly, there's a bunch of helicopters throughout the course of the stage. Uh, 
and their missiles can very easily knock you out of a jump or a hovering over this or that. And that's no good. Whoa! This is annoying. Yeah, they start sending backup. They start just sending suicide trucks at you to have those bombs on them. I keep forgetting there's one right there. Every time I do this stage, I kind of turn around and, oh crap, there's a, <laughs> one of those things. There. Oh, hostage box. The nice thing is, uh, you don't have to re-rescue a hostage box when you go back into a stage. Anything you've acquired no, just not again. stays acquired. Of troops has been defeated. Oh, put a sock in it. <laughs> I really kind of wish she could actually talk to him, and the two of them would banter. I think that would have been pretty, pretty damn hilarious. You get the two of them just bickering back and forth while you're blowing crap up. Like I said, not gunning straight for the end of the stages, because I, I am trying to, you know, get most stuff that I can on the first go. Although stages like this especially have a lot of kind of nooks and crannies, I'm sure I'll miss things, uh, whether I like it or not. There we go. Oh, good. Well, up there, I thought I'd actually completely missed that. Fine. Or maybe it would have been hilarious. I don't know. But it didn't happen because I... It did hit. So, no worries. Hostage boxes. A musician was among the POWs you rescued. I wonder if the vice president wants to go as far as to control the music in America. <laughs> actually, I think... The very first musician you rescue, she says something to the effect of, uh, he was forced to play music for the troops, or something like that. But, I mean, they're, they're, she's always basically pointing out that everyone's being forced to do stuff for Richard's regime, so. Regime? Regime? Oh, whatever. Whoa! A bunch of dudes I didn't really notice if was there. Destroy the enemy radar, destroy all the bombs and liberate the town. She just interrupted herself. Hey, okay, come on. There we go. It was directly behind me. Man, I keep missing a couple guys. Well, actually, I think they were coming out of the building I was trying to destroy since those uh those square little armored buildings, they actually just produce uh regular little soldiers. There's a really annoying couple of hostage boxes in this stage. They're actually up on top of the, the like, mansion buildings off to my right. But you can't actually get up on the roofs. Like, it's not possible. I've actually flown up high, got, got myself up high enough that I should have been able to just go straight onto the roofs, and that didn't happen. Okay, gotta be careful here. Okay, now I can set the bomb off. Because, yeah, once the hostage box is actually broken, it doesn't matter. The, the characters running out from them are invincible or whatever. They're not actually targets. There we go. Alright, let's see if I can... Metal Wolf has infiltrated the garden of a big mansion. The home of international superstar Money Money Gold. Money, money, gold. Have with a what? Man. That is the Maybe stupidest name. Can I shoot it from here? No, of course not. I don't know why I... You see, that's... Yeah, there's a hostage box up there, and it's really damn hard to get to. Okay. Yeah. Go up there. Oh, did I... Dear. Okay, good. That did not hit the uh, hostage box. Oh, man. He's destroying the mansion. Add destruction of personal property to the breaking and entering charges. The U.S. <laughs> Constitution is downright powerless against Metal Wolf's evil. <laughs> oh, man. That guy. That guy. 
this guy. Not even. Can I stand on this? Apparently not. 